Good morning, everyone. It's Tony with Just Start Fishing. I hope everybody's doing well. I am back, finally. As you see, I'm in the middle of the woods again. Different set of woods. This one, I'll show you in a little while. I'm not up there quite yet, but uh, this one's got a couple old houses. This is another park right where I live, but as you see where I'm at, the uh, reason I'm on this spot right here, this used to be up to about the 70s, this was a field. But main reason why I'm here, just checking the field, to see if there was a house that I can't find on my map. You know, so, you know, back in the day, 1800s or whatever, you just never know where old house site was. I've looked, I've only been about, I only have about halfway through the field. I got some more areas to go check, but I haven't seen anything yet, as far as, you know, like old chimneys or well or anything like that. I'm still looking. But reason I turn you on is that hole right there, and I missed my target. I dug down eight inches and come to find out it was three inches in the ground. But it ain't much. Got me an old, as I drop it, got me an old shotgun stamp. It looks like a Remington 16 gauge. I'll clean it up better when I get home. But uh, that's what it is. As soon as I find something else or if I find any sounds of an old house, I'll show you. All right, see y'all later. Hey everybody, it didn't take me long this time. As you see right there, just a couple inches in the ground. I got that piece right there. Looks like it's a leg or something. Not 100% sure. We shall see. Alright, see y'all later. Whew, what's up everybody? As you see, where I'm at this morning, I wanted to show some of the newbies and people are just getting into this hobby some of the things that we have to do as a YouTuber or as metal detecting period on what we go through to get to our spots and the time it takes. Sorry, the camera's a little shaky. As you know, I'm walking. <clears throat> But that's where I was the other day. Right there in the meeting. Like one of the, the two clips you saw before this. But, uh, you know, some folks, as you see right there, the main river is right over there. And there's a spring for it right there. You know, a lot of folks don't know that what we go through to find the good spots and to get our spots and all of that. And I don't know if you notice, but I'm walking uphill. I'm a quarter mile from my car already. And uh, that'd probably be half a mile time I'm done. Uphill. So this actually used to be the main road until this park came in here. And then the park took over. And it's a bike path, walking path. I think the only people that drive on them now is the maintenance people. Because <coughs> no traffic comes through here anymore. Except for running and walking and riding bikes. But I was going to go on the lower end. But it's kind of kind of wet. I don't know if you noticed. That's where I was. Right in there. But I figured I'd bring you all along. As we descent. And I tell folks. What we really go through. You know. Some of us walk farther than this. To a spot. You ain't gonna find your treasure off, off the road. If you're lucky. Let's say with a house. And then you get lucky. But you know. It is what it is. I figured I'd bring you all along. Deer tracks all over the place. I can find another shed. Like I did the other day. 
that's about where I was. Or right up there is about where I was. I thought about going back to where I was, spot I was at, but I thought about hitting the house this morning. And see all of my pictures, that shows, that shows that a field. Oh, that was a field. It was never a house there. But as you've seen in the clip, I was finding some iron pieces. So, debating if I should go right there. Go back to where I left off. And just give it a check. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's go. Let's do it. We're out of here. Take a little break. But for all you newbies, this is what we go through to get to our spots. Thought I'd share. All right, we'll see y'all on the first one. I'm back again. I decided to get out of that field. I'm gonna go check out the houses. So the higher, the better. See them plants right there? Them right there? You got them all the way up through here. All the way. Up there at the top of the hills where the house was. Get set up. Seen first signs of deer. I was walking on that field. Looks like I ain't gonna be able to get to where the house set. Cause it looked like to me that was right in there. That's what it looked like. It was covered by briars. I can do the outskirts. There used to be a barn set right over there. barn sit right over there or over there, in there somewhere the other house this used to be the main road I might be able to get in there there's the main house big two story house sit right in there but it's full of briars well, that's a bummer. If I can get through them briars, I can get it. And deer tracks all over the place. I've been wanting to come to this place. And something told me to do that field. I did. I might have to go over there and do the barn. Yeah, because main house sits somewhere right in there. I just don't know where. The other house is right down here. I had a bunch of barns. Now that I'm here, I might as well go check it out. It's right there. Because they were neighbors. And there was an airport right over there. It's full of briars. We ain't getting over there on that side. Keep hearing stuff, but it's my mat on my book bag. Oh yeah. I don't think I'm coming on this spot. I didn't know that was there. This is creepy. I wish you rest in peace, y'all. This is the owners of the land. Right there. It has to be. I'm not here to disturb anything. I'm just looking. I promise. You see the main road went right through here. This was the main road. Y'all gonna come walk with me? I'm not doing nothing. I'm just looking, y'all. I ain't trying to disturb nothing. I promise. Let's look at the house, y'all. 
I see why I just call it Graveyard Hill now. Look at that beauty. Ain't she a beauty? Tell some stories, I'm sure. Definitely could not come over here in the summertime. Definitely could not. See the tracks for the deer. See the house right there. I'm not here to disturb nothing. Talk to him. Look at that. Oh man, look at that. Somebody caught it on fire. I hate the way people treat houses. Leave them alone and respect them, y'all. If you see a house empty, respect it. It didn't do nothing to you. Old sink. Old wash tub right there. Look at this, y'all. Look at that. Beautiful place, beautiful place. Old soul machine right there on the old soul machine table. Watch out for nails. And they beat build on back here, lean to. Can you imagine living in places like this like they did back in the day? They made a home, made a living. Life was a lot easier back then. It was tough. They didn't have much, but they made it they made it work. Side of the house. Oh, the area. Old tree stand right there. Hey, everybody. As you see, I'm in a thicket this morning. But right here, about two inches in the ground, won't very far. I mean, it was a jumpy signal, but I decided to go ahead and dig it anyway. And not real sure what it is. If you know, let me know. Looks like a corner, corner to something, to a table or something like that. And you just never know an old home site like this, because I'm pretty sure by the map this is where the house sat. But as you see, it's like a thicket through here, so it's going to be slam picking on swinging spots but i might have to jump over to that barn but if you know what that is let me know all right later what's up everyone i'm back again as you obviously i'm back again but uh i'm still swinging on this old home site right here it's giving me up some square nails I'll show you. Uh, I'll take pictures of them and I'll show you. And as you see the piece right there, it's heavy iron. As you can see, remember I found another piece like that down in the field. There's some writing right here. I can't tell what that is. But that looks like a sewing machine leg or something. But I'm slowly, slowly getting it. As you see, I'm in the thicket, so slimming is there. And I got that water spot right there, so I wonder if that was, I wonder if this was where the house sat right here. And that's part of the cellar hole. That's what I'm wondering. Tell me your opinion. But I figured I'd show you that right there. Telling stories. I'm gonna leave it with the house, but that's a heavy piece i don't want to carry that out but definitely 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 we'll see you on the next one later what's up everyone i'm right here by these three little trees right here as you see 
just a couple that's in the ground. I had about a 14, 15 signal. And I found that. Oh ho. But if you something different, let me know. I won't but three or four inches in the ground. So I'm finding all this farm equipment. I wonder if they're I wonder if they didn't have a whole lot of money in these hills. You never know though. You never know what's gonna be here. Alright. See y'all later. What's up, y'all? It didn't take long me, me long at all. Find something. I've never found, I've only found like one whole one, and it was bent. But I keep finding pieces, as you see right there. Right there. Give me a half one. It's been a while since I found a whole one. So maybe I will. Maybe I'll find a whole one. All right, see y'all later. Hey everyone, I'm back. Still finding some iron pieces. I had many signals through here. But does anybody need a chain? I got a piece of one with a hook. I'll send it to you. I'll give it to you. Free shipping. Alright. <laughs> See you later. Hey y'all. As you see where I'm at. I'm below the house because the house is up right up there on the hill. I got all this to detect. But right now, I got a 100% chance of rain coming in the next 20, 25 minutes for the next two or three hours. And I'm about a half a mile from my car. So, this is where I'm going to end it. Thank y'all for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. There's plenty more here. Plenty more times I will be back to detect this. So we will definitely, definitely, definitely see y'all in the next. What's up, y'all? It's me. I figured I'd show my face. I ain't showed my face in a while. And you walking out with me. Like I said on that last clip, they got a 100% chance of rain coming in the next 20 minutes. It might take me 20, 25 minutes to walk back to the car, so I might make it just in time. But you can see. There's tons, tons of area to explore. So, but I would definitely, there's a wash pail right there. Yep, an old wash pail. I can't flip you around or I would. Old piece of a barrel. You can see it right there. But, I'll definitely see all the next. Got bricks down here too, so could have been a chimney right here. Could have been a barn or something right here. Got some pieces of brick. But like I said, we'll see you on the next. I'm going to get out of here before I get soaked. All right, later.